Yo, what up? Read your mind, Urban RCLA. It's Christmas time in Santa Monica. Um, I recently went down and I found my new favorite hobby shop on the planet, Pegasus Hobbies. Uh, they're a great shop. They're located in Montclair, California. Uh, they've got, they are literally the biggest hobby shop I've ever seen. So I went down there, I met with Tom, the owner, and I started chatting with him and I was like, yeah, you know, I have my own uh, YouTube channel, I make these RC videos, and you know, I, I think you should check it out. Anyways, he checked out my channel and he, he called me back in, so I went all the way out there again, it's about an hour drive, but it's worth it. And I said, hey, you know what would be really great is if I could make you a few videos and do it for some trade. And he was like, that sounds like a fantastic idea, let's do it. And I was like, what, really? So he slapped a shirt on me and he, he basically completely hooked me up. And if you haven't checked out the Pegasus Hobby YouTube channel, please do. It's Pegasus Hobbies Shop. Uh, there's gonna be some videos up there pretty soon about what they have at the shop. And if you're in Southern California, I'd encourage everybody to go check it out. So one of the things that I picked up when I was there um, was this. Um, as many of you know, I use the 4PL, which is basically this one. This is the one I use for my Baja. You can see it's taken a little bit of a, a beating. But I decided I wanted to try out, because I've heard a lot of good stuff about this one. This is the DX4SR. I picked this one up uh, because, uh, first of all, Tom hooked me up big time, because I want to be able to run Spectrum receivers which coincidentally already come pre-installed in some of my favorite rigs. Now, as you all know, I have gone through the Axial SEX-10s, those are my first ones. I've had Viteras. I've had ECX Torments by Electrix. Um, I also have uh, a couple of Traxxas. I have the Traxxas two-wheel drive, which I upgraded, and I have a Traxxas 4x4, which I'm gonna be upgrading tonight. And I have a Baja 5BSS, which I got from Dave's Motor. I love my Baja. So far, my Baja has cost me a lot of money in all the upgrades I've done. And the reason why I bought the Baja was so that I could afford to get it to the level that I wanted to. The low C was just too expensive. It was getting to be around $5,000 to get it to the level I wanted it to be, including the radio and things of that nature. But thanks to Pegasus Hobbies and thanks to Tom down there, I have something to share with you guys. You ready for this? Now, I just got home, so ladies and gentlemen, look at this. I, could, I couldn't even fit it in my trunk. I could, couldn't. Let's see if I can get it out for you so you can see. <laughs> one of these at a time so this is actually the display unit which I was a little bummed about because I had everyone's you know sneezes and fingerprints all over it but I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna basically check it out make sure everything's there all the instructions all the pieces everything and then Horizon Hobby has a great tutorial on their website when you look at the, at the, uh, the low C5T that basically shows you exactly how to set it up you know the, the the areas to play, all that stuff, um, setting up the receiver, attaching it. So I'm going to go through that process and hopefully we'll have some running videos for you guys pretty soon. So Merry Christmas to me. Thanks Pegasus Hobby for hooking me up. Everybody, thanks for watching my channel. I appreciate all the support. You guys have been awesome. As always, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. And I'd love to hear your comments. So if you think I should do some upgrades to this before I even run it, I'd love to hear your suggestions because I've been looking through Dave's motors 
and there's a lot of options. I just want to know what's absolutely necessary. So thanks again for watching. Urban RCLA, I'm out.